dining out remains high. Because of this, experts say less people are eating out on a regular basis. And local restaurants are feeling the hardness. WFXR's Anna McDougal joins us now live from Lynchburg. Anna, you talked with a local restaurant owner. What'd they tell you? Yeah, guys, well, the cost to run a restaurant, the rent, the food prices, the staffing, all of that is going up, which is leaving, leading some of these restaurants to have to make tough decisions when it comes to operating their business. And a lot of times this does include raising the price of their food. I've had to make some decisions. I've had to change business hours. I've had to raise the prices on our food. Did not want to do that, but unfortunately, shopping on a day-to-day -day basis, the prices of food have skyrocketed. A beloved location in the Lynchburg community, Val's Comfort Kitchen is one of countless restaurants dealing with rising prices and decreasing customers. It has fallen off some, um, especially after the holidays. January was a terrible month uh, business-wise. People were just not eating out as much. Braxton even had to get rid of a position to cut costs until things pick up. We're just, as a team, we're just making it happen to cover that position. Nancy Hubbard from the University of Lynchburg says studies show that up to 80% of people say they're eating at restaurants less and less due to inflation. They stop taking part of activities that they see as luxury activities and dining out is one of those. But she says restaurants are getting creative to combat that. Some restaurants have tried to pivot much as they had to during COVID uh, and come up with new ways to attract customers on days when they're not normally busy. Hubbard says there's no real timeline on when some restaurants and customers may see some relief in prices. Now, some good news in all of this. Braxton did say that today being Valentine's Day, the restaurant was pretty busy, and she says that holidays in general are usually still really busy, even during the times of high inflation and high costs. She says holidays are a crucial part of keeping her business afloat and running. I'm live in Lynchburg, Anna McDougall, WFXR News.